you came into my life. I thought that I was dreaming because you showed me in your dance for life and your way to breathe. Ouvrez-moi à danser mon chalet dans tes besoins. Chanter en d'autres mélodies, bon moi Les opposés, si a aussi moi Ou reconnaître non, bon moi En pas de pays, soit caché encore You My angel in disguise I saw your wings one night I know you Hot love in your hands Hot love in your words Oh, dis-moi où aimez-moi Avant même où te connaître-moi Qu'on s'y nous déjà joie En d'autres chemins Aucun bémoi, vloupez-moi À d'en chalanter besoin Ou chanter en d'autres mélodies pour moi Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful I don't wanna let you go Until I tell you that I love you Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Your man, body and soul So perfectly designed Sous yeux qu'à chanter, moi ça vous Connaître qu'à y liberté Ça c'est vérité Close to you, around you My heart is singing a new song Words and melody coming from you Comfort you, holding you This is my own fantasy Just want to breathe the hair surrounding you Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful I don't want to let you go Until I tell you that I love you Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Your mind, body and soul So perfectly designed
In 1994, a mission group to Haiti found Herbie at St. Vincent's School for the Handicapped. Operated by the Episcopal Church, St. Vincent's helps many children who are unable to attend regular school because of one disability or another. Herbie was sitting under a tree and the group noticed that he had no ears. Herbie was a deaf child who had been emotionally scarred by his appearance with no ears. As Herbie once said, the older people said, I look like a snake. Dr. Mark Mitchell Jones, a plastic surgeon at Piedmont Hospital, was shown pictures of Herbie. His love for Herbie was instantaneous and he approved the case. The proper procedures were put in place, including a visa, hospital stay, and Herbie's lifelong host family, the Kavanaugh's. Over the next two years, seven surgeries were performed using cartilage from Herbie's ribs, skin grafts, and some available ear tissue to make two brand new ears. The next stage was the opening of an ear canal on one side where Herbie had a functioning inner ear. Dr. Ronald Steenerson, neuroodologist at Northside Hospital, is Herbie's surgeon who made the ear canal from skin grafted from Herbie's arm and an eardrum from the lining of a cheek muscle. The surgery was a success. With the help of audiologists and a bone conduction aid, Herbie can now hear in a normal range. Life in Haiti is not easy. Over the next few years, Herbie had to deal with malaria, typhoid fever, an appendectomy which occurred on a visit back to Atlanta, political turmoil, and then the earthquake that leveled his home. But Herbie's story has a wonderful ending. Through the love and support of many individuals in Haiti, Atlanta, and Child Spring International, Herbie has a job in Haiti with 410 Bridge, whose mission is building a community for the deaf displaced by the earthquake. Herbie works as an interpreter and guide for mission groups traveling to Haiti. Thanks to Child Spring International, he shares his gifts in three languages, English, Creole, and sign. Serving children, Child Spring helps to restore their lives. Physically, by providing the surgeries and the medical care. Emotionally, by restoring self-confidence. Spiritually, by giving unconditional love. And mentally, by providing scholarship opportunities in their home country. Herbie's case is an awesome example of Child Spring International's vision to heal the whole child. Encore 